Okay, this is something at Dayton that I wanted to share with you guys. And you saw, you heard about this from Ed in Palm Bay. He said, Eric, you got to check out the MV1. Then I come into here at Dayton, and of course, here's Expert Electronics. And then I see the MV1 right here on the side, and I see it on display. So I figured I'd ask a couple questions and show you guys something other than ICOM and Yesu and Flex becomes this type of full SDR. And um, my friend here is going to, what's your name? Wasili. Wasili, okay, will you give me a couple of questions, uh, answers? Yeah, sure. Okay, so this, give me a summary for someone that doesn't know. This is a full SDR, this is something with a computer built in. Give me a description real quick on what, what this is, for those who have never seen one. Okay, uh, this is fully standalone radio. This is modern uh, SDR DVC transceiver. They like sampling uh, radio signals to digital forms. Uh, the main idea of this radio, uh, SDR transceiver and regular computer uh, placed in one box. I, I have seen, uh, heard that from my friend. He says Windows 10 computer is built entirely into this. There's, sure. there's no need to have a computer and a radio. It's all in here. Yeah, right. this is the main idea of this radio. Uh, transceiver has internal You have computer. a mouse here. You have a mouse with it. <laughs> sure. He's controlling the screen with a mouse. Look at this. Sure. The mouse connected to uh, transceiver via USB, wireless adapter. Right. You can minimize SDR software and you can see. Oh my here is gosh. a Windows 10 operational system. Is that is that touchscreen? Yep. Wow. It's touchscreen and you have full access. For this for this uh, computer inside, you can install any ham radio software, loggers, digital mode software, FT8. But now with with this, you don't need. Uh, do you have to have like if you want to do FT8? Do you have to have an external program in that running, or can you do FT8 right on the screen? Uh, you can install and run FT8 software inside to the radio. Okay. And you can use it at the same time simultaneously with uh, SDR software. For example, right now we have a big display connected yes. Let's to look the at radio. This. Look how nice that looks. Mode, but, uh, a standard yeah. operation, I, I, I can extend external display. This is just a Windows 10 extend. So, uh, you can see that internal small display used for SDR radio right. software. And then you have a dual, the mo other side is the, wow. So I get, wait, can I have YouTube going here while my radio is going here? Is this connected to the internet? Not now, okay. but you can connect radio to the internet via wireless LAN, via LAN cable connections as you want. Oh my gosh, so wow. You can move uh, radio software to the big screen and small screen will, can be used for other tasks, uh, applications as you want. Because this is a regular computer with two displays now. You can connect three displays if you want. You can use external 4K resolution display with good uh, picture, no what, problem. What about the specs? This is a i5, an i7, a dual core. What's inside of this? Uh, we have two different specs of so one radio. Basic specs i5 processor, 8 GB RAM, and 120 GB SSD solid state drive. And the extended version, uh, we called it MB1 Prime with i7 processor, 16 GB RAM, and the 1 terabyte uh, solid state drive. Wow. Uh, what 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 is the band coverage? Will this do all the way to VHF UHF? Uh, full coverage from HF up to VHF bands. So all HF bands, six meters and uh, two meters band. Also. Wow. Let me look at the back. Has it got a lot of connectors on the back? Sure. Oh yeah. Look at that. HF with four HF antennas and two VHF antenna ports. Yep. yep. With a LAN port. Wow, look at this. HDMI output. HDMI display port. Four USBs on the back and two on the front? Yep. Wow. Four USB 3.0 on the back side and 2.0 on the front panel. That is just amazing. What has ham radio become? <laughs> this is, this is uh, no need for me to have my computer. Sure. I could just get the computer off my desk and use this yeah, with everything. Radio also includes uh, building power supply. Uh, from uh, 100 volts up to 240, 
you can use it in every country, any country of the world. You can take, make, you can uh, take the uh, to your trip. Connect, just Re connect re electricity remotely, remote, remote, yeah, and remotely too. Wow, that is just. Uh, I'm gonna have to take one of these. But for those who are wondering, the website. Where's the picture of the website? I want to show uh, right here. I'll zoom in so you can check this out. ExpertElectronicsSDR.com. Software defined radio. This is real software defined radio. This is computer with radio built in. I mean, it's. I could probably go all day talking about the features, but a preview from Dayton Hamvention. Thank you for your time, my friend. Thank and, you for uh, the addition. And hope we get to do more with this and play around with it in the future. So this is what you're missing at Dayton Hamvention 2019. 7-3, everybody.